so many dishes to do. Klondike Bar! Boo! Oh man, how's everybody doing? Evil Dave here from Magic the Gathering Attitude. <gasps> I was just doing my taxes. Yeah, unfortunately, death and taxes even apply to me. Well, the taxes part. But uh, question of the day, and I'll juice this up as we go along, is what do you think about taxes? Because most people are going to say, I hate taxes. Like, who likes taxes? But so, a lot of people get money back, you know? They have like kids and stuff and... And stiffs. Oh man, well, hopefully something's good in there this this week. Oh, Capenna's been doing it rough lately, man. Oh, oh man, have we got something on Tuesday too with this? Just saying. Actually, I put that right there. What else we got here? Oh, we got uh, that, that crap mystery cube. Yeah, we'll yeah we'll see what's in that thing. And uh, okay, we got uh, Theros times two. Actually, you know what? Theros times three. I got another pack here. It just happened to be around here. It was left over from Tuesday too. Dom Remaster times three. Brothers War. Blister pack. Sticky stuff. <laughs> oh, Modern Horizons 2 collector. Theros collector. I got it out of the blister pack, so it started to like tear on the bottom. I guess that's kind of normal. Hey, get off me, Dom. Put this out of my hands. <sighs> Meriden Mercedes. See if we get that Blind Steel Colossus. And... Oh, eighth edition, grave packed. Anyone? Just saying in me. So there you go. Hey, um, oh, the box just fell, but it doesn't matter because it's made of steel, like me. Just saying. Just saying. Hey, uh, shipper, speed this up. Ugh, and we're back. Okay. Had a belt. Sorry about that, folks. Not really. All right. Uh, promo packs going out with the lucky fan. That's a thing. Uh, we got a little bit of sun here coming in here. I wanted to go outside, but it's slightly windy. And uh, even I'm conscious about cards. 13! Haven't had a 13 in a while. Oh! Mm, Crush you. Going out with lucky fan. Along with those two scoot swarms down there. So, <coughs> excuse me. <laughs> Allergy season. By the way, ah, yeah, let's just do it like that. Why not? I got a little crap on here, man. It's like all over my hands. Like, get off me, man. What's going on with that? All right. How is everybody doing today? I hope you are doing very well. I'm having a fabulous day. Signed art card and land card always goes out. Well, it doesn't have to be signed, but art card and land card always go out with a lucky fan. So I hope you are all doing well. I am doing fabulous. Get that card. Uh, sees, a, sees a little play in Arena. So, there's a question for you. Gala Graders. Okay. Oh, wow. It's Gilded, too. Hostile Takeover. That's actually not a bad hit. Not bad hit. Beautiful Gilded Foil. Wow. Camera does not do that justice. You know, shoots his scores. But, um, yeah, I've been playing Arena lately, and I'm just like, oh, man, I, I really want to cut some actual cardboard again. It was so much fun at uh, Tony's place when we were up in uh, Michigan. And uh, we just had a blast up there. We really did. And I, I already miss those guys. I, I truly do. So I don't miss that onesie. But <laughs> Jenny Faye, sure. And, oh, okay. We got the uh, it's the Secret Lair type card. Uh, Arvanox, eh, it's like in the dollar area. Uh, and Mystery Monday is all about value. And we did very good last week. Hopefully that doesn't show up. F that limousine. That is not the type of limousine that I want to be taking. I'll tell you that right now. But getting back to Arena, um, and I am belching because I am drinking a beverage. Um, ugh, horde hauler. Okay. And yeah, just throw that out. Ooh, shoots, he scores again. And it's just, yeah, it just isn't the same. 
So uh, we do have a thing called Magic Jerks uh, that we do play on the channel. Um, Editor Jay is like, no, no, you're too afraid to go on. I gave you a 15 minute warning 15 minutes ago. It's all that good stuff. Scheme and fence. Okay. Yeah. Skywall. Why couldn't you be a trial, man? GD. And uh, yeah, it, it's actually kind of fun. We just uh, we just sit there and beat on each other and just talk crap. Actually, I usually beat on uh, Editor Jay in his face. Beautiful mountain. Gorgeous mountain going out foil. So, man, I hope we get a banger list card here. God, I, I have not hit a triome in some friggin' time, let me tell you. And, ooh, Falco. I'll take Falco. Sparker. Mm. Another freaky foil back there. Okay, Shadow Mentality and Vampire Scrivener. Ooh, we get a list card. Oh, that's from, uh, whatchamacallit, Dominaria. Not bad. Tempest Gin. We'll take it. Take that. Two list cards so far. Not bad. List cards are kind of weak sauce in this uh, this set, for damn sure. But it is what it is. You know, Capenna. I, I'm. I, I said this a while back. Capenna has warmed up to me a bit. So uh, fight rigging. I think that's a little something. And incriminate. Oh man, maybe I should change the question. Who's ever been incriminated? Now nah, go with the taxes because it's like tax season and stuff like that. No one likes doing that. So uh, yeah, my wife. My wife's like. Uh, well, we, you have all this money that you got on Patreon and PayPal. I'm like, baby, I didn't make any money on it. I didn't want that card to show up. Cement shoes. No, 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 no! I'll sign that. And, um, yeah, it's just, I'm, I'm like, honey, we, we kind of took a loss. <laughs> and after I, I tallied up all the, like, because we, we shipped for free, essentially. When I tally all that stuff up, she's going to like be over the moon because we will probably get money back for the first time in many years. So, and I pay extra in tax a year. Halo Fountain. Mythic, but not the one you want to see. It's it's actually a D's card. It's not horrible. But that bundle was... All right, guys. Stand by. And we're back. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go with the cube. Why not? Right, let's see what's in this garbage. Ooh. Full... Oh, 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 hello, pretty. That actually fold over. Nick's Lotus, uh, probably like a buck or two, but probably more than the two dollar mark. So, and this should be another one in here. Yep, Kogla. Not bad, not bad. And a set booster. Uh, hey, you guys are getting three of those. Uh, well, somebody is. Oh, relic tokens. I, I forgot these were in here. Oh, man. I think this is my last one, too. It was like, uh, I, f I just found a random cube sitting at a, uh, a Wally world and I just decided to grab it up so all right uh, and this is like some like some crazy token that I don't have yet uh, these will go out with the fan I always send them out okay oh that is foil that's merit laid I haven't seen that one yet flying indestructible okay that's I think I might keep that one because it's foil all right and a food token and a golem token okay I think the food token or the treasure tokens worth a bit but so I don't know. We'll, we'll see what's up. I like that Iconic Masters pack, though. That's pretty sexy down there. It's good. I, and I am a Mana Drain Magnet. Hopefully she shows up. Come on, Arlen. Come on, Arlen. What do you got, girl? You know you want. You know you want to see me. Every girl wants to see me. All right. Joking, guys. Joking. I am uh, a very ugly man. Even I will admit this. Okay. Ludovic. <clears throat> oh, hard. And hungry for more going out with the lucky fan. Why not? Ooh, you got a token in the back there. Who's it? Token creature human. All right, iconic masters. Can't, you know what? I'm not going to complain about that cube. That's a, I, 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 this is, I'm telling you, this is an underrated set. And you can still get them for relatively cheap. So, uh, okay, fog bank. Hmm. Lure. That goes way back to alpha. Carbon. Ooh, cryptic command. Okay. Crypto Command is between $15 and $20, if my memory serves me correct. Unless it went way down because I did get the uh, the reprint. And Search for Tomorrow is a definitely a little something in the uh, the comment slot. Eh, we'll go, we'll just, I'll just open up the Strixhaven one real quick. This is You guys saw how I got that out of the uh, the junk pack from CBS. <laughs> but it is Japanese, so these things can have some uh, fire in them. Can. Probably not. I think that means Mountain. Actually, I think that means mountain. I don't know. Just saying. 
All right, here we go. Let's, uh, let's see if we can get out of here. <sighs> okay, set pack. Hmm. Not what we want to see. Uh, that's some stuff. <laughs> that is a mythic, and I can't remember. It's a black card. I can't fucking remember what it is, man. That's a good card. I will find out what that means. So, and I will uh, probably keep that one, but maybe I'll give it. You know what? I'm feeling a little saucy today. I have no idea what that is, but it's going out with Lucky Fan. Roll your windows up and sing to this. I didn't juice myself up today. Hold on. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's delicious. That is delicious. All right, let's see if we get in the chaos bundles here. Or pack, whatever you want to call it, chaos box. Send it right on there, dummy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, curator of mysteries, not bad. Going out with Lucky Fan. And... Oh, 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 I paid $13 for that. I mean, Evil Dave paid... I mean, uh, BBD. I stole his bank card. Oh, all right, let's see what's in here. Ah, oh, come on, man. We, we need a hit. We need a hit. I just juiced up, so we should be good. I'm starting to fire up here now, man. Okay, Child of the Pack. Glorious Sunrise. Hmm. Nothing glorious about that card. And we got a Twirl card in the back and a Wolfie Token. Yeah, Wolfie Token, I'm a fan. Why not? <laughs> all right. Anybody have a Bark at the Moon? Bark at the Moon. All right. Stop being dumb, Dave. Just pull something good. Please us. Entertain us. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Ben, baby, this is a five to eight dollars of course proving ground. We'll take that. Very nice. Finally, a GD goddamn try on. Haven't pulled one in a while. This tourist proving ground is pretty good. So I'm surprised those those lands are so low in price though. So they're not, they don't even, they, they can't hold the jockstrap of the original Triomes um, from the Godzilla set. Valakid Awakening, nice hit. Not bad, not bad. Uh, I can't think of the, the set name off the top of my head. I don't know why. I'm just going to rip right into it. Ikoria. Jeez, man. Come on. Come on, evil Dave Solari. You're going to wake up, man. All right. Oh, oh this stuff's and stuff's and there's something. Stuff. Oh, that's why. Oh, we pulled another one. I pulled up one of these a few weeks ago. All right, set boosters, who cares? Need hook call today. All that good stuff. All right, uh, Valkyrie Harbinger. I think it's like a buck. And then Cleveland Reaper. Oh, my God! Just got cleaned. So I'll sign that one. I'll send that one out. So uh, this, though. These these are almost up to $25 a pack. And and well worth it, mind you. So what's this? Oh, D&D. &D. Man, I guess we might as well go with the set booster packs first. D&D &D AFR. <sighs> if I could just pull a gnaw bone for myself, that would be really nice. That would be really nice. Okay. I do play D&D. &D. Uh, I'm really cool. If you guys can uh, check it out, please check it out. The link will be in the description. So uh, it is fun. I'm on there like once a month. Cleric class uh, could be around a dollar. Triumphant. You know what? It's going out with a fan though. And you hear something on watch. Hmm. What did you hear? What do I see? Tell me, DM, so you can screw the party over. Cause that's what DMs do. They just screw the party over. Blue Dragon. That's going on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me. If you thought that was rude, please say that in the comments. <laughs> Battle Cry Goblin. <laughs> All right. Oh, Horde Robber. Crap. Choose your weapon. Guardian of Fate. Not bad. And you see a pair of goblins. Jeez, you're on watch and you see a pair of goblins. That's not a good day. All right, Midnight Hunt. What do I always say? Let's get a Meat Hook Massacre and call it a day. Beautiful island, by the way, that is going out to a fan. And I, I will put something, like, not, like something somewhat of value in there. I will. I always try to put one good card in there. Sludge Monster is not that card, though. Silver Boat. Uh, Bolt. I will not uh, insult you all by putting Sludge Monster in there. Hmm. The All-Seeing Eye. Imagine being that. There you go. Beautiful mountain foil. Probably around the dollar mark. <laughs> Jay's going to play dollar-ish. Okay, clear shot. Chop on the arms. Come on, man. Show me a heater. It better be in that friggin' Zendikar pack. Ooh, consuming blob. Not the mythic you want to see, dude. I will give that out to a fan, but I'm really not giving you much there. Arcane Infusion and a Twiddler card in the back. All right, guys. Stand by while I clean up this crap. And we're back. 
All right, Zindi Pendy's Horizon. Uh, all the uncommons and common cards that are foil, I will give out to the fan. Fan question. Do you like taxes? <laughs> Nobody does. Okay, undo inversion, borderless. Okay, that's something. Oh, okay, crack crown pathway. It's about, what, th well, three to five, based upon uh, the foil or not. See if it's, uh, sometimes the foils are less. Clear water pathway. Great card. Borderless. Very nice. All right, we got uncommon. Okay, fearless fledgling. And we got, we got a rare on the back. Ah, clear water pathway again. Full art. Uh, that's probably pushing the $10 mark just because it is a, uh, is a foil. So, all right, stand by, guys. Look what I put in the fan pack. Okay, there you go. That's the non-foil version, but again, that's probably, uh, oh, God. <sighs> Anywhere between five and eight, I'm going to say. So, uh, we'll see. Okay. Ooh, Nick's Bloom Ancient starting off with finally Daryl showing its face. Boom, boom, here's a banger. I'll take it. Nessie and Beetlehorn, nobody cares. Madoma's Prophecy. Hate that card. Sees a ton of play, and we'll just go through these right quick. So, and there you have it. There you have it. So today is April 3rd, 2023, and uh, my brother uh, passed away in 2008, April 9th. So, but uh, what, I, just got, I got geographically embarrassed there. Nothing to see here. And um, he, he passed away from uh, leukemia. So he had a, a, almost a six-year fight with it, and he went into remission a couple times, and just he didn't gut it out. It wasn't his fault. Nothing you can really do. But it's been 15 years this year, and on April 6th every year, he and my and his friends and some of my friends who are all there, beautiful swamp going out. Oh, finally, finally, you sick son of a bitch! That's like a $35 crocs. Boom, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Who cares? Try, yeah. Great version of Ass Poodle. Nobody cares. Hilly has punishment. I don't care. Sorry. Anyway, going uh, going back to uh, my brother. Oh, man. Woo. Sorry, guys. That then, That's worth a drink. I'm going to sit down for this one. Mmm. Mm. Oh, Crocs, you filthy freaking card, man. Um... On the 6th of April, three days before he passed, and you can look it up, uh, Joseph D. Solari, Norton, Massachusetts. Oh, no, not even Norton. Uh, he was living in North Attleboro at the time. But uh, uh, April 9th, 2008, his obituary is in there. Uh, that was my brother, really good looking guy. But uh, he was always the life of the party, always a funny dude. He'd make fun of you when you laugh, laugh the, the, bet, the most. Isolated Chapel, one to two bucks. Not what you want to see, but anyway. Um, on the 6th of April, we all got together at his house while he was on hospice. And we're just like giggling like little schoolgirls, like poking fun at each other like we always do. And it was six days into his nine days of end of life. And the nurse came over to us. She's like, whatever you're doing, keep doing it. And we're like, why? He's like, he can hear you. This is the quietest he's been all week. Cliff top retreat, not bad. Not bad. Those will age well. Those, uh... Those lands, they're just, they're not, just not expensive right now. And uh, so every 6th of April, we get together, we go to his grave, and uh, my parents' grave, it's the same one, and we uh, we throw a couple back and uh, talk crap with each other, <laughs> about each other, and it's just a good time. Denison of the Deep, hmm, yeah, nice, okay, nothing to see there. All right, guys, more to come, stand by. And we're back. I'll get a picture of him so uh, Editor Jay can put it in there. And I, Editor Jay, I won't call you a shepherd on that one. I'll call you a fathead. Um, <laughs> he's like, oh, thanks. Oh, sure. Uh, commons and uncommons going out. The foils, that is. So, yeah, uh, we after that, we uh, we go finish ourselves off. Soul Partition. Uh, Gixie and Puppeteer. Mm, geology Enthusiast. Okay, so this, this would have been worth some money at some point. But uh, yeah, not anymore. Boom, saws ready. Okay, conscious spike. Okay, no, not bad. Cyclonus the Saboteur. It's not the uh, shattered glass one, but Chromy Lantern Foil. There was a time when this card, its schematic, was really worth a ton of money. 
Not anymore. Not anymore. I'll say that because it's foil 10, May 8 to 10, maybe. Oh, this is no Disney's no introduction. But uh, after that, yeah, we go down to a local uh, tavern that we used to all hang out with as uh, young 20-year-olds. And uh, we finish ourselves off there, uh, mostly me. And it's the calibrated blast crap. Uh, it's the one time a year where I, I pay for everything. I don't let anybody pay for anything. Why don't we ask kids about the Urban Square? Bam, baby. Cabal Coffers Borderless. Wow. We will take that. That is at least a $30 hit. Probably more. Probably more. Chatterstorm, who cares? Oh, my God. What a fucking pack, dude. Oh, Force of Negation X Retro. Oh, my goodness. Wow, it's titanium protector and our dog. I really don't care about that card. But Jesus, tap dance in Christ, that, that, that is a pack. Wow. Wow. Force of Neg, probably 50 bucks at least. That is just insane. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Wow. Income the values. Woo! Man, man, tearing it up. Tearing it up with it. That's why MH2 is just the shit. It really is. Oh, man. Okay. I forgot how these go. Um, okay. Dreamweaver. Oh, beautiful island going out. These are these are like two bucks. And the mountain, around $2 too. All right. Underworld Sentinel. Nothing to see here. All right. What do we got? Temple of Malice. Okay. Uh, full art. Um, uh, Scryland. Eh, probably about a buck or so. Okay, where oh Heliod's intervention foil, not bad. Not bad. Probably pushing the six dollar mark, maybe seven. So we'll have to see. We'll have to see. Okay, uncommon. Okay, <laughs> I'll give that one away. Not like I'm giving you anything. Calafi and okay, and a human token in the back. Alright guys, let me clean up this. this. Oh, that was a battle. Stand by. Oh man. Come on, Blightsteel Colossus. Come on, Rare Foil. Meriden Besiege, man. Wow. These things are almost 20 years old. Imagine that. Damn, man. Oh, maybe, maybe my brother's with me right now. Come on, man. Come on, Joe. Show me a little love, man. He's like, I'm not showing you love. You used to beat the crap out of me as a kid. <laughs> Until he turned around one day and popped me in the nose. And he broke my nose, man. First, the first of three times my nose was ever broken. Oh, Quilt Slagworm. Okay. All right, Sangromancer. That's a that's not a bad card at all. We'll take that. And oh, shit. Okay. I'm gonna put it off to the side. And we did get a foil. Not bad. Rock Wolf. You know what? Fans got it so good. Or patrons. All right. If a Grave Pack foil comes out of here, I am gonna drop trow, shit on the table, and eat it. But if we don't. If we don't, okay, shock troops. We'll go through this one kind of slow. These are it, it just the like the old art, man. You just can't beat it. Can't beat it. White bordered, you know. I, I personally, I like black border the best. Black border was just so sexy looking. Okay, we're getting into the uh, uncommons. All right, we get confiscate. Not a bad uncommon. All right, swarm of rats. Sure. That's actually not a bad card. And oh, salt marsh. Okay. That is actually not a bad hit. One of the first dual lands that like came in tapped and whatnot. What do we got in the back? Okay, we got a forest. <laughs> Nothing like uh Mahamadi Jen. Oh man, and there's no there's no foil on the back. Mahamadi Jen is a little something, probably not for eighth edition. But you know what? We're gonna do it. I'm gonna give it away. You know why? Because you guys are F-word awesome. And uh, we couldn't do this without you. And we surely appreciate everything you do for us. So, there it is right there, guys. Hey, much love, everyone. Don't forget to do your taxes. And don't forget to throat punch somebody in the groin. Until next time, deuces.